Uh, Dave, I've just seen you do, um, what was it, eight rounds with uh, yeah. a giant of a light heavyweight <laughs> in uh, Stephen Ward. Yeah, yeah, it was good, I enjoyed it. Um, we made feel welcome down here, so it's good sparring. He obviously needs it for his fight for uh, for next week or whenever it is, and um, I've got a fight at the end of the month, so it's a uh, quality sparring um, that it's worth the travelling for. Uh, didn't you come down last week as well? I came down last week, yes, and I might be down again for Conrad. It just depends um, on what's happening next week. But as I say, I don't mind travelling for the quality and um, the quality here. So, is this uh, the first fight since um, the defeat to uh, Rocky? It is, yeah. It's the first, um, obviously, the defeat and a die surgery. So it's me. I've just got it all clear to fight again. So um, I'm looking forward to getting back in. It's been a it's been a hard ten months. You were telling me before. Was it was the the eye surgery? Was that an issue before the fight with um, Rocky? Um, I had it, had it even before the Australian fight, but um, it just gradually got worse and worse. But um, it's not like an excuse. I could see perfect when I was in the fights, you know what I mean? I could see perfect even in the field of fight. I could see absolutely perfect, but it was just after it was just gradually getting worse, so I had to get it had to get it done, you know what I mean? To and how long did that keep you out from the gym? Well, uh, I got it maybe five months four or five months after the last fight and then obviously the recovery period is the same again, you know what I mean? So this is me just mm. really getting back in. I couldn't run, I couldn't um, train because of double vision, you know what I mean? So that's, it was, this is just starting from scratch again. So I've got my, got my shit together and um, feel good now and uh, sparring's coming on, you know what I mean? It was hard to get back in it, but it's coming on. Well, I'd say that I enjoyed that there. It was, um, like I say, Stephen Ward is, is a giant of a light heavyweight, absolutely huge. But you didn't look out of place there with him. It was a, it was a good uh, tip for tap throughout the whole fight. Uh, it's, it's, it's good. Um, he's got the longest arms I've ever seen. I think so. It's uh, a bit frustrating, but um, it's good. Um, he's a big guy. He's a big gentleman. He's a he's a really nice guy. Um, and I think um, I think he'll do do well in this next fight. I think it's going to be his. But um, it's a good good spar. It keeps me thinking all the time. It's not just a war. Mm -hmm. I need to think all the time with his his long arms. So. Um, you're going to take some of the tin. So what you're hoping for now? I know you said you've got a little six rounder back up in Scotland. Yeah, I just need to um, get in the ring again and get um, get back moving. You know what I mean? Um, just just to feel feel under the lights again. You know what I mean? It's been a hard ten months, as I say, without it. Um, so just get in there and then let my team do their work. MTK's looked after me. And you you still going to be at super middleweight? Yeah. Well, we were talking about actually trying to move down to um, middleweight. We've got to try, but um, it's my legs, and I used to play football for a living, so my legs are absolutely they're quite bit bigger than normal boxers. But <laughs> if we can do it healthily and safely, then we will. But if not, then it'll be we'll be staying at super. I was talking to you before, and I was watching you hit on the on the big bag there. And when I was checking your record out before you fought Rocky, I was looking at you, obviously you went over to Australia, and you know you, you stopped a kid that you weren't expected to to stop. No, I wasn't. And uh, was it the seventh round? Seventh round, yeah. I thought I thought it could have done before that, but um, the seventh round, yes. But why would you have thought that? Because I think prior to that, you'd only have two stoppages. Even though they'd come in the last few fights, it was. Well, it, it, you, you're not known as a puncher, but. No, I'm not known as a puncher. As I say, when we got off of that fight, I've never ever said no to a fight, and I've took fights that probably I shouldn't have, and people were thinking this is one of them. But um, I knew I had to take the fight away from him. Yeah. I knew he didn't like, he was a come forward fighter. And it's it's very rarely that people get me back away, you know what I mean? So mm -hmm. I'm all, I'm forward, so if I can get him in the back foot and after the first round I knew that, so I knew that was it. Yeah. I had him beat at the way in. I had him beat the way in because I wasn't getting I wasn't coming home in that fucking flight home <laughs> uh, without a belt. It's a long way to go, isn't it? It's a long way to go, so nobody expected it, nothing lost, but the only two people that I actually thought we were gonna do it was me and Billy, so mm. um, and it worked it worked too, you know what I mean? But our uh, strategy was, was bang on, I mean it worked well, so um, I think I deserved it, you know what I mean? So. Yeah. So, uh, I presume uh, the British and Commonwealth are, are vacant again now, are they? Yeah, yeah. Um, there'll be things that you'll be looking to maybe... Of course, of course, as I say, baby steps, because it's uh, I can't just jump back in. Well, 
I need to get this first. I feel good just now, you know what I mean? I feel I feel healthy, I feel fit again, you know what I mean? Yeah. Which is which is something I've not felt in a long time, um, because of what's been happening. Um so it's just good to be back, it's just good to be back in the gym, it's good to be getting hit in the face again for a bit. It's, it's weird, it's weird, but you, you crave that when you've not got it, you know what I mean? Just the feeling again sparring and getting vast, you know, and it's just a good feeling. We're, we're all men, we're crazy, you know what I mean? Boxers, but it's just yeah. it's just, it's you, just I think you've got to be to step in there it's and it's a way of life, you know what I mean? It's a way of life, so but um, I'm enjoying it just now, so I'm enjoying the sparring coming down here, go back home, go train again. It's a long, it's a, this is, you've travelled on three hours this yeah, morning? Yeah, but it's, it's worth it, I've done it loads of times. Eight time. hard rounds and then you're travelling straight back? I've done it loads of times, I used to go to Gallagher's gym and spar 12 rounds and drive home, And but if you need quality then you, you need to go looking for it, you know what I mean? You are good, um, Jamie and that's good enough to... Well the North West is booming isn't it? Yeah it's it is, it's, kids. it's a successful gym, success breeds success in a gym, you know what I mean? You can tell that just walking in here, this. The, the atmosphere in it, everybody's happy, everybody's um, training well because they are happy fighters, so yeah. it's good to be around that. Yeah. Alright, well it's been a pleasure talking to you Dave and good luck with your fight coming up and, and obviously whatever comes next mate. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. Bye bye.